Hey guys, it's Christina Marie here with October favorites. Can you believe that it's November? Today is November 1st and I'm filming my October favorites. Um, it blows my mind every time another month uh, flies by and I know everybody says that but it's just so true. Um, so yeah, I'm here to bring you some of my favorite products from skincare, hair, um, makeup, clothes, and non-beauty. So let's go ahead and get started. For my skincare products, there are three things that I just wanted to quickly show you guys that I've really, really loved. Um, and two of them are from CVS. And they are both pretty much the same thing, just different types. Um, and they are the um, pre-moistened towelettes. Uh, this one here is, I think, the cleansing and makeup removing uh, towelette. And I really, really love this. It has a textured feel to it, so you feel like you're kind of scrubbing to really get the makeup off. So I really, really like that. And then the other one that I really enjoy is the exfoliating cleansing uh, wipes. So I really like those because those have, have kind of like a scrubbing surface to it, so you really are getting that exfoliating feeling. So I use both of these. I use the makeup removing ones first, and I use the exfoliating ones. So... Then the third skincare product I really love is the Bioderma cleansing water that I got from Amazon.com. This one is um, for oily skin, which is me all the way, if you can't tell. I look orange in this camera here. My skin, like I've mentioned in another video before, my skin is not playing around. It's changing all kinds of colors. I'm really tan one day, I'm orange one day, then I'm, I don't know what's going on. But uh, yeah. But I really, really love this. It really gets all of the dirt off of your face. And you just need a little bit on a cotton, cotton swab. So I really like that. Or a cotton pad. Hair care products. I have two things for you. The first thing here is this uh, Paul Mitchell Hot Off The Press um, heat protectant here. Which I really, really enjoy. Um, you can spray it before you use a flat iron or um, a curling iron or a crimper, anything like that. And then you can spray it afterwards to lock in the curl or the crimp. So I really do enjoy this. Then the next hairspray I really love is the Chi uh, Shine Infusion Hair Shine Spray. It just really gives my hair a nice sheen after I've styled it. So I really, really enjoy this as well. It's almost gone. It feels maybe it's about like to here. So I've used this a lot. The biggest section, of course, is the makeup section. So let's go ahead and get into that. The first things first, I'm going to go ahead and just break it down by certain um, areas of the face. For the eyes, I've really been loving Max Satin Taupe, which is this beautiful color right here one of my absolute favorite shadows I have it on right now um, then I also I have it all over the lid and then I also love max uh, corduroy which is what I have in my crease to kind of soften the harsh line after I put on that set and taupe so I have that there and then actually the base that I use before I put any of that on is max uh, quite natural which is this right here. You can tell that that's well loved. I really, really love it. It's a nice uh, satin paint pot. And then um, for my crease, after I put on corduroy, I will use Urban Decay's, let me pull out the brush. Uh, what is that? Busted, which is that shade right there. And that's actually my everyday look. That's the look I have on right now on my eyes. For my eyebrows, I have really thick eyebrows. So I just typically, I don't like to do much with my eyebrows. I just, I like to go as natural as possible. They tend to get a little out of control every so often, but not too much. I use the uh, Maybelline Great Lash, the clear, the clear mascara, and I just use it for my brows, so. There's that. Mascara for my lashes, I use two. I use the CoverGirl uh, Clump Crusher. 
uh, by Lash Blast, which is this right here. And this does exactly what it says it does. It uh, <laughs> crushes the clumps. There are no clumps in this. And look at the wand here. It's a really, it's a curved wand, but it's a really nice wand and I, and I use it every day. So this is what I have on my lashes. And then also I use the Buxom Amplified Lash Mascara with the expandable wand. This was also a September favorite, so you may remember this. So here's this wand right here, but then it also begins to extend. So I really love this mascara and this is what I have on my eyes right now. The next uh, section I'll go over is the face. So my setting powders that I really like to use. And the first one is uh, Ben Nye's, um, what is this? the Ben Nye's Mojave Luxury Powder in Nutmeg, which I really, really love. And then I just use that really just under the eye area. And then to set my whole face, I use um, a Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder in um, Translucent with extra coverage. I get this from CVS. It's like six, seven bucks. And I really, really love it. It smells like baby powder. It smells really, really good. The concealer that I use, not after, but I use the concealer before setting, of course. Um, I use the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Concealer. And this is in the shade Honey. Now this is extremely light, but I'm okay with that. Unfortunately, the area that I live in, they don't carry the darker one. I think there's one more dark darker than this but I just use this and I just make sure I blend it out really really well doesn't really matter because I'm setting it with the the Ben Nye powder anyway but I love this because it really gets rid of the dark circles and actually any fine lines I have puffy eyes like right around there is where you typically start to notice and this does a really really good job with concealing that my blush I have two I have a Max um, Sheer Tone Shimmer Blush in Sweetest Cocoa, which is this right here. I love this. I actually just um, purchased this in a haul. I have filmed that video, it just hasn't gone up yet. It'll probably go up within the next few days, so you'll see that again. And then the next blush that I really, really enjoy is um, Tarte Amazonian Clay Blush in Natural Beauty is this right here and I have a combination of those on right now you can't really tell because it's the end of the day but I'm very very I, I use this very very lightly very lightly because I want the prominence just to be the illumination on my cheek for the lips I have been using two MAC lip products all month and the first one I've been using is um, Max lip glass and hot spell and this is from the mac naturally collection that came out back in like june or something like that and um so i really 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 love this shade then the next one i use is a plush glass and this is uh, max plush glass in ample pink you can see i've been using quite a bit of it but there's that in ample pink love it love it love it it gives my lips a tingly feeling too. Next thing I want to get into is clothing. Things that I've been wearing a lot all month. First thing, let's do the scarves. I have one on right now. This is um, a flag scarf from Free People and this is in the charcoal color or the black color. I also have the one in taupe. And so these are just really, really pretty, really big too. I love how big it is. And so it just, hey, hey, is really, really nice and it goes with everything. But I got the one in black too, because the black one goes with everything. But this one I just love as a nice pop of color on any of my outfits. Um, if you want to go to my blog, I did an outfit of the day with this one. Um, 
So make sure you check that out as well. Next favorite is sweaters. I've been really obsessed with sweaters, but my favorite one of the ones I've purchased recently is the one from Forever 21. This uh, tan and pink sweater here. I really, really love this sweater. Um, it's just really comfortable and oh, just really, really soft. So love that one. Boots. You guys remember back when I did my first fall haul video, I talked about these boots. My Kenneth Cole reaction boots that I thought were absolutely gorgeous. You can see how much love I've given these boots. I, they're still amazing. I love, love them, love them, love them. So they have been a staple in my collection all month. I've been wearing them almost every day. So there's that. The last thing are my non-beauty favorites and just a couple of things. We're gonna go ahead and talk about this book here. Uh, this is from a haul I did recently. It's called, um, oh my gosh, it's called 13 Reasons Why by Jay Asher. I just finished it a couple of days ago. And this was a really, really interesting book. I will do a book review on it. It's basically about a girl who committed suicide and she uh, made some cassette tapes and sent them to the people who she deemed responsible or played a role in why, the reason why she committed suicide. And there were 13 reasons why. Um, so if you would like me to do a review on this book, please leave a comment down below and I definitely will do that. Ooh, the lighting just changed. Okay, let me hurry up and finish. Next favorite is an app on my iPhone slash iPad, and it's called InstaFrame. It was introduced to me by my friend Missy from work, and um, here it is right here. That's the app right there. It's called InstaFrame, and it just allows me to make a collage of all of my photos. You really can't see me, I'm dark all of a sudden because the camera's focusing on the, on this. But um, yeah, you can make different um, collages. I mean, and they have so many, so, so many. You can change the style, the size of the photos, all that kind of stuff. And the cool part about it is once you're done, you can actually share it to your Instagram or to your Facebook or to your Twitter. But Instagram right there is actually an option. So that is really, really awesome. So that is my app of the month. Last but not least, my favorite food or snack. Strawberry Newtons. I love these things. Um, as you can tell, I'm down to like the last few. So these are really, 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 really good. I eat them at work when I have downtime or when I just have the munchies. So yeah, that's it. That is uh, the end of my favorite video. Those are all my October favorites. I'm ready and raring to go for the month of November, Thanksgiving and the holiday season. I live in a place where it snows, so it's probably gonna start snowing this month. Oh well. Um, but yeah, just wanted to remind you guys I am doing no vlogber. That's what I deemed it. And I will be vlogging every day in November. So um, make sure that you check that out and support me in that as well. I thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please make sure you comment down below, you like this video, and you subscribe. Uh, and I will see you guys soon.